So I start off taking one thing, and then all of a sudden, here comes the curve. The curve was two weeks ago. I'm trying to figure communion meditation. What do you say? And then it slowly starts coming to me. Then I start realizing something. When we talk about the crucifixion, that's not the end. That's just part of it. The center of this scripture is the resurrection. That's when it became complete. Now, once we get to the point that we realize that he's alive, he's at the right hand of God, and he's here. Some of us find that hard to understand. And if you've accepted him, he's within you. He's there. Now, I have to make a confession. The confession is going to be a sin. This past week, I went through one of the most horrible Sundays I've ever had. I suffered agony. It's called diverticulitis. Now, I'm having a whoopee party. I'm feeling sorry for Paul. And then I recall something that's located in a drawer in my room. It's the notes from the doctor that say, no peanuts, no popcorn. Guess what Paul was doing a month before he got the attack? He was eating peanuts and popcorn. So I could look at God and say, okay, God, no, no. God said, I have done it all. I have sent my son. He died on the cross. When through faith you accept him, I send you help, the Holy Spirit. Read my word and I will guide you. Now, unfortunately, when do we get to that point? When do we get to the point that it's so painful that we realize we've got to turn to him? And then I'm sitting there one day and I'm looking at the woods and something occurs to me. When God cursed it, when they got the, the sin, do you know what he did to the earth? He cursed the plants. Why do you think there are thorns out there? But all of a sudden, I saw something else that I had never thought about. I'm looking at the plants now. They're proclaiming him. They're proclaiming Look at the buds of the trees. They're saying newness, new life. The earth is telling you that he's real, he's alive. Turn to him. He didn't die in vain. He's standing at the door. You're going to pass people all day long that do not realize that. If you haven't opened the door, open the door. Let him guide you. Once I learned to rely on him, I look back over my life, I see footprints. And in those footprints were, it was really hard and I only saw one set. The reason there was one set is because he was carrying me. Your choice.